Hello, and welcome to Content Stack. In this video, we will learn what stacks are and how to get started with them. A stack is like a container that stores all the content, data, and settings related to a project. So for example, you could have one stack for your marketing website, another for your knowledge base website, and so on. You can create multiple stacks in an organization. Let's learn how to create stacks and perform more basic actions. In your content stack account, go to an organization where you have the permission to create stacks and click on this button here. Provide a relevant name, a description, and then select a master language and click create. This will create your stack. This is your stacks dashboard where you can see your recent content you can also add new widgets to this screen. Within the stack, you can create content models, add entries and assets, view publish queue, deploy releases, check tasks assigned to you, and do a host of other things. To view your stack details, go to settings and then stack. Here, you can view and edit your stack's basic details. You can also see the stack's API key that you can use to make API requests. If you no longer require this stack, you can delete it, or you can transfer ownership of this stack to another user. If you are not the owner of the stack, you will see a Leave Stack button that lets you leave the stack. To add collaborators to a stack, go to Users and Roles. You can invite users by adding their email address and assigning a relevant role. Lastly, to monitor activities of your stack, go to the Audit Log option. Here, you can see every action performed by all the users of this stack. That's a quick overview of stacks. You can view our videos on other modules to learn what else you can do within stacks, or log on to our documentation site to find out more. Thanks for watching.